Improving treatment strategies for cardiovascular diseases is a major challenge within the field of regenerative medicine. Here, we induce the regeneration of a blood vessel inside the body by using a cell-free supramolecular scaffold which replaces the injured tissue. In this scaffold, microfibers form a network providing special support for new cell growth. These microfibers consist of smaller self-assembled nanofibers, which are formed by stacks of uridopyrinidinones, or UPs in short. Bioactive UP modified peptides, shown in yellow, are incorporated to provide necessary biological signals to cells, while other UP building blocks are introduced to meet the mechanical requirements and to add anti-fouling properties. Since the self-assembly of the UP groups is reversible, this imparts a dynamic nature to the material. Tailor-made materials can be developed by a simple mix-and-match strategy of customized UP functionalized building blocks. These new materials are characterized by their dynamic behavior, with the ability to respond and communicate to the surrounding native tissue. For example, biological signals at the luminal side of the scaffold selectively recruit cells from the circulating blood. Here, peptides assembled with the scaffold direct the cells to differentiate into the desired phenotype. As a result, endothelial cells will cover the luminal side of the scaffold and are surrounded by vascular smooth muscle cells in the medial layer. Due to the dynamic nature of the scaffold, formation of the new vessel is accompanied by gradual resorption of the scaffold material, ultimately resulting in a fully regenerated tissue resembling the native blood vessel. Supramolecular materials form a new and promising generation of smart materials within the field of regenerative medicine. The mix and match strategy applied here allows for tuning of the material properties towards application-specific demands, not only for replacement of coronary arteries, but also for the development of heart valves and peripheral blood vessels.